friends is Tracy and Violet from Nova Scotia Living. And it's like 9 o'clock in the morning. We totally slept our arses in. But I didn't go to bed till late, like almost midnight, so. Oh, what good gentlemen. Look at them. I'm so proud of you. I don't mind you partying once in a while. Oh, there's Randall. But, yeah. Good job, boys. Good job. Randall heard us, so he started calling. Anyways, yeah, it's Monday morning. There's Larry. Larry and Flora live behind us. Um, they're the ones I say, well, they're artists. That's what they do. He makes beautiful jewelry, and she paints beautiful paintings. But he was just walking to his car. Anyways, yeah, we slept in. Had a good day yesterday, Mom's birthday, which was great. And now it's a fresh new, fresh new day. Mazaya's up. Yes, boys, I hear ya. They see us coming. Um, Violet, we're not going down there. We're not going down there. Why don't you come down here and say hi? Come down here. Yeah, he's not gonna. He's like, whatever, lady. Giving me the stank eye, but I'll, I'll get him to like me one of these days. Yes, yes. Oh, there's Larry going right now. Oh, and he's coming this way. Just hold on a second. Wait, while I let. Come here. I'll see if he. Stop. Hi, Larry. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, I don't know what we're going to do today. There's still a little bit of chili left, but I'll probably, I have some freezer meals I need to use up, so I'll probably take out one of those, and we'll see. We'll see. I'm feeling better today, for sure. I'm going to take some more medicine when I go back in, like I've been taking that. So Robitussin breaks up mucus and phlegm and stuff. And the Tylenol cold stuff. And I'm going to take it again today. But yeah, yeah. I am the type of person, I think it's probably my asthma. Like if I lay down sick, and I do lay down if I'm sick, if I have to. Yes, I'm just talking to these guys. Um, I'm prone to get pneumonia. Like, I've had pneumonia several times in my life. And it's not, like, if I need to lay down because I'm that kind of sick, I do lay down. But I just make sure that I'm propped up some so I'm not laid right down the whole time. Something my mom told me anyways. So, but I wasn't pneumonia kind of sick this time. But I was scared that it would get like that if I was a bump, but I didn't have a dramatic fever or anything. It was just, just like sinuses and a little bit of a cough, like my ribs are sore and I haven't even been coughing, but I'm coughing a little bit, but not like hacking away at it. But anyways, she's about to pop a squat, so I'll be back. Oh, I just got back, but just a minute, Violet. I, this, they must have just put this here yesterday. Sugar, I am lost. I've wandered away from my home. Please call my mom. Nancy. Oh, sugar, sugar, sugar. I'll have to keep an eye out for her. Oh, that's heartbreaking. She's beautiful, isn't she? Randall, you guys, keep an eye out for sugar, please. Violet, you too. Well, Nancy, I don't know who you are, but I will keep an eye out for her. There's a, there are, I think there's a few in our yard now. Let's walk around this way. Yeah, they're all around us. Yeah. Oh, they love to sing us songs, don't they, Violet? <laughs> they're flirting with us. They say crows can bring messages from the 
from the underworld or the other world. I wonder if that's what he's trying to do. There's another one. I don't know. I don't know. <sighs> All right, friends, I have my coffee. I've just been bumbling. Well, not even bumbling. I've been a bump, honestly. It's 1038. Um, and I'm just taking my medicine now because I'm a slow arse. But, yeah, even my medicine is 50% off. I do have some actual Tylenol cold, but I want to use this up before I use that up. And, yeah, it's still not expired. Not that I go by expiry dates personally. But, um, anyways, I'm taking a daytime one. And then I take this cough control extra strength I'm not really coughing very much but it loosens mucus and phlegm relieves chest congestion controls dry cough soothes throat sore throats due to colds lasts up to six hours so I'll take that about twice a day and that's what I'm gonna do now all right guys I just heated up the rest of that chili so that's done which is fantastic Misha came down with an irritated eye so I put an eye drop in her eye reluctantly she was like I can't I want to do it I want to do it she couldn't she couldn't bring herself to do it so I did it I had to convince her to let me do it like she I didn't fight her on it like I wasn't gonna make her let me do it but then I um, I don't have any regular tea bags so I'm doing a English breakfast tea bag and she's gonna hold it on her eye and it always makes it better tea bags warm tea bags on an eyeball makes them feel better so there you go I want a cup of tea not to do a tea cup chat or anything I want a big fat mug of tea um I'm a little more winded today I feel okay but I just want a big mug of tea and I think what I'm gonna do if you have seen whoo oh violet I had bought 50% off King Cole. I didn't realize them that they were Keurig pods. I'm going to have one of those. Give those a whirl. Oh, this is one of one of many <coughs> oh, excuse me. Mally sketchbooks and she some of them are old pictures. Like these are older ones. Oh, she just had Yeah. Yeah, those are older ones. Oh, that's pretty cool. She just doodles around with it. She's a girl of many talents. Yes. All right, there's, it turns out pretty dark. I'm impressed, actually. Not that I generally spend I wouldn't spend money on buying these. Like this is $9.99 regular. So I spent five bucks, which 12 cups <coughs> of coffee. I ran this through like 14, like 10 ounces and then four more. And it's still really dark. So I'm impressed. I'm going to just add a little cream to this and I'm going to sip on this for now. Misha, <laughs> how's your eye feeling? Horrible. Does it? Yeah. Well, that'll help. No. If it gets too cold, dip it back in the hot water and squeeze it out and put it back on. Okay. And then if you're really thirsty, just drink the tea. <laughs> oh, oh, I'm out of breath. I just went downstairs. I haven't even took a sip off that tea yet. But I just took out chicken broccoli cheese casserole, May June 8th. It's all it froze wonky, but I'll take it off and show you. All right, looks darn good. It's pretty much chicken casserole with broccoli and cheese. Um, so I'm going to spray this side of it with cooking spray and kind of tint it over. I'm putting it in the oven at 350. It's 25 after 1 now. It'll be done by supper time. Should be. Okay, now I can sit down and have a sip of that tea. 
I don't know if you can hear Mace, but he is turning himself inside out because he's going up for a bath. And Violet doesn't know what to make of it. Every single time. Like he has a bath almost every single day. Some days it's fine. Other days he just doesn't want to stop doing what he's doing to go have a bath. But my husband's going to give him a bath. I'll cream him up. He'll be good. And I, I got mixed up with the days for the kids for the week. And I realized Mally and Messiah were supposed to be in this day camp this week. Like starting today. And I'm like, for F's sakes, because Mally's already going to a special camp starting tomorrow. It's three days. It's a pride camp. Tomorrow, the next day, and then the next day, three or four days. And so anyways, I called them, left a message. They called me back. So I got Messiah and Mally switched out of this week till to the week of the 23rd to the 27th or whatever it is. And Matt, Misha and Mays will go next week, which that was the original plan. But, uh I just don't have the mental stamina for this foolishness right now. I think Marquis just pulled in the driveway home from work. So, anyways, I'm just gonna wait on. How was work? Do you go back? All right, I'll be back, guys. Ooh. There we have it. It's 4:59. I just took this out of the oven. I didn't even poke it but I'm assuming yeah that's done I mean this is already all cooked I just needed to defrost it and warm it up so now I just need to put it on some plates all right friends let's do this there's one of my flippers there's one are you going to eat now yeah Well, you'll have to hold your horses, Mace. Do you want this one or I'll give this one to Zaya? I don't know which one you have. No, the first one in the That's the big piece. It is. A lot of it's still in there, but this is a big helping, so I don't want to over overload it. Oh, there's a piece of cheese dangle. There. Yes. Anyways, I'll be back. Mally wants to get hers. Sans camera. friends it's the next day it's like seven o'clock I just got home I had to drive Marquise to work he asked me if I'd drive him because he was super tired which quite responsible of him for sure so uh, everybody was still asleep when I left I'm gonna go up and get Violet and then we'll go for a little walk oh. okay we're out 
Oh. Yeah, I'll probably just squish yesterday and today together, but what are you doing? It's tangled around your back leg, silly. Oh look, they're still standing. I didn't notice that when I was out earlier. Exciting. I don't hear any birds, but you can hear all those cicadas. The birds will come out after. I did see Randall and his buddies when I pulled in the driveway, but I don't know where they are now. But yeah, that little clip you've seen of me driving just before I said, oh, it's the next day. That was where Marquise works. He works at like a resort, like in the kitchen, like as a porter or whatever. Whatever they do. I don't know, cleaning tables and stuff. Come here, Violet. Let me fix your... Violet. Come here. I'm just trying to fix your leg. That's not very comfortable there. All right. No, 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 no. Come on. Oh, there. Anyways, Mally goes to camp today, which is exciting. She doesn't have to be there till 10 o'clock, though. So we'll uh, take a spin into town and maybe go to the store. We'll see. It's a little later than I usually like to go, but I don't know. Maybe I shouldn't go now that I think of it because I still have a bit of this cold and you're not supposed to go to stores when you have a bit of a cold, so I probably won't now that I think of it. Ah, dag nabbit. Oh, there's a little bird. <laughs> Anyways, I'll be back in a bit. Oh, you're going to try to get that bird, are you? Yeah, I don't think so. All right, I haven't checked in in a little while. I just dropped Mally off at camp. I had a million forms to fill out, but she's there. She'll be done at 3 o'clock, so it's from 10 to 3, which is nice. But now I have to pick Marquise up at 11, and it's 10 after 10. So I might as well just bum around in town. I forgot my friggin' bank card, so I can't stop and get a tea or something. And I can't go into any stores anyways. And I don't want it, Dad to get my cold, so... Uh, luckily I brought my book, so I'll just find some place shady and read my book a bit. Well, I think I'm just going to go down on this beach. I haven't been down on this one. This is one that's right in town. Like, right in town, just at the end of... One end of town and oh yeah I brought my book that I finished yesterday I might do that's not necessarily a teacup chat because I don't got any tea but I have a bottle of water that's been rolling around on the car floor that I can drink look at all the seagulls and this is just an open beach I mean it's a rocky beach it's not like a nice sandy beach but it's beautiful all the same I used to ride my bike down here and go adventuring when I was younger yeah. I need to find a nice dry spot, but yeah, it goes on and on and on. It's beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. So I just need to find a spot where I can <sighs> sit down without getting wet but yeah it's only 10 o'clock in the morning and it's pretty hot now so it's gonna be hot 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 this afternoon but I got a little time to burn so what better place to do it than a place like this right oh, there's a shell probably a piece of an old scallop shell yeah, I think so. I think it looks drier over here. Don't worry, gulls. I'm not coming to intrude. Oh, do you got any beaches like this near, near you? I suppose all on the coast of each state or province or country, but... Oh, look at that rock. That's nice. <sighs> yeah, 
that we have beaches like this all over the place. So anyways, yeah, I'm going to pop a squat and do my little book chat. Alright guys, the sun at my back is hot. Marquis just messaged, messaged me and he said, okay, soon. So it's like 20 to 11. Made good time. I did my little book talk. It was, it's book one of this. The Devil's Lair. The other one's The Angel's Cage, I think. Molotov Obsession, book one. So anyways, I'll make my way back to the car and yeah, I'll pick him up. And then I'm going to head right home. And I'm going to see if my husband will pick Mally up. Because I don't want to have to come back into town for a third time. And I can't even go look for my deals, for goodness sakes. Because of this dang cold I have. <sighs> but I am feeling better. I did take my medicine this morning. But I am feeling better. So that's a good thing. Anyways, I'll be back in a bit. Well, actually, while I say that, you probably want to see some of the beach. Just while I walk back. Why not? Oh, oh Lord. Oh, oh, there. I know they're all watching me. There's the crows. Yep, there's shells and glass, like beach glass. There's a scallop shell, not a big one. Scallop shell. I hear ya. Report back to Randall, would ya? Yeah, they're all over the place. Yeah, right there watching. Probably like, what are you doing here, lady? Who the hell are you talking to? I'm talking to you. But, no, I used to play down here. I think we came down here like as in school, like doing beach sweeps and stuff, picking up garbage if we found any. Yeah, I see ya. But yeah, some of these houses right there. That'd be a nice place, you know, to have a beach right on your front deck. So yeah, this is just right, right in town. This isn't the beach that you could swim in, really. But, I mean, I suppose you could, but it'd be awfully cold. Awfully cold. You have to have shoes or you cut your feet all up. So, anyways, I just parked right there. And yeah. So, anyways, now I'll be back in a little bit.
right, I made it to Marquise's work. I'm about 10 minutes early or so. So I'll just wait here. They have, I used to work here years ago when I was a young teenager, like as a babysitter. But yeah, it's the fanciest place around here. So <clears throat> he's not allowed to go in the main entrance. He goes way over on the other side. So when he messages me, I can drive over there. Otherwise he'll have to walk over here. But whatever. So I'm just going to sit here and read my book a little bit. All right, here's the employees area, I guess. So, yeah. He said spin over now. I want to jump in that buggy and take it for a spin, but I'd probably get in trouble. Oh, you know what time it is. Eh? Bad time. <laughs> Alright guys, it's 12.39. I need to feed these children. I got a bag of pizza bites up in there. There's still some leftover casserole from last night. But I'm just going to do up a whack of those pizza bites and they can have that. <coughs> Marquise is, er, Maze is all creamed up from his bath. And I just want something I can do in the microwave, so that's what I'm going to do. Alright guys, well it is 6.51. <coughs> oh, excuse me. I got a carbonated um, water. My husband picked some up for me. This is watermelon kind. I've had it before. It's okay. It's not my favorite, but it's it's still good. Anyways, I'm going to end this video now. Um, I know it's a squished one with two days. It's not all that long, but I do plan on filming tomorrow too. And I am feeling better, believe it or not. I'm still congested, but I'm... <laughs> I don't know. It's just hanging on. It's hanging on. So, anyways, I want to get this edited and uploaded. We found Evie. There's Evie. My, my mom has a YouTube channel. <laughs> I, have you ever? I have, do you, I have a lot of toys. You have a lot of toys. Yeah. I bet you do. Can we show? And start fresh again tomorrow. So. Here, Violet. Jump up here so they can see you. Come on. Come on. There she is. There she is. Yeah. All right. You're trying to get stuff on the computer desk. Anyways, I want to say peace, love, and happiness today and every single day. Please like, share, and subscribe if you so choose. But if not, that's okay, too. I still love you. I still want all the happiness in the world for each and every one of you out there. I certainly do. I really, really honest and truly do. Yes, I do. So, <clears throat> yeah, the kids had, oh, she's doing it again. The kids had the leftover of that casserole and just some things. And uh, Mally had a good time at camp. I'm getting your eye crust. Um, she had a good time at camp, so that's good. They went to Pizza Delight for lunch. I'm like, oh my goodness. And they did tie-dyeing today, I guess. Um, they had hoodies there, and they tie-dyed them. So, whatever colors they wanted to do. And, yeah, that's exciting. So, she's she'll go back tomorrow, and it'll be good. It'll be good. So, I'm proud of her for going, because it's quite brave. It's the first year they're doing this camp. And there's not very many people going. But, it's the very first time this camp is happening, and it's providing a safe space for... People, young, our young, fragile people, teenagers, they might seem rough and tough and big chips on the shoulder, but they're just fragile kids. They really are. And they need a place. They need a support that they can be themselves. So I'm so happy that this is available. Anyways, with that, I need to stop talking and get the show on the road. So have a good night or have a good morning. And I will. See you tomorrow. Bye. Boink.